All right, now I got the camera strapped on. I can use both of my hands, but a little backpack here. And Ann says there's baseballs in there. Oh, there they are. I was about to say, where are they at? But all done in the bag. A whole bunch of baseballs. And it sounds like seashells in the front there. Huh. Yeah. Yeah, that. I'm going to look over here while she's doing that. But Oh, you, you called it right on. Oh, there you go. Seashells. <clears throat> but over here, I've got, we got some stuffed animals, but that one right there is dirty. We got Sonic here. He's, um, I don't know, it looks like maybe a dog got a hold of some of these. So stuffed animals on the top, not so good. Once we get down in here, what are we going to have? What is that? Okay, that's a shelf. Hard Rock Cafe glass. Just all kinds of stuff just thrown in there. Definitely have to look all the way down here. Here's another little Pokemon book. There's no cards in that one, but if you look down in here, it's part of a phone. A lot of paper, paperwork in this one. We keep moving over here. We got more, more dirty animals. That's that stinks. This is a cool one right here, King oh, Koopa, but he's a little bit dirty. And then we got Bucky here from oh, Bucky. Bucky's, and he's a little bit dirty. And see right there on his hand, looks like something chewed on him. Oh, it's probably the rat, I guess. Maybe the rat was nibbling because it's just like little, little nibble marks. Like right there, look, the rat chewed into in these spoons. Hmm. You think the rat's in here, Ann? Okay, Ann wants to call it a mouse. That makes her feel better, thinking it's a mouse instead of a rat. Got some rugs. I don't know what these wood pieces are down here. Let's see. Oh, it's like some kind of wall art. I want to see what this case is right here. Little black cases. Let's see. Little vault. And there's nothing in it. It is. And then down in there, we've got ties. I can't quite, those are kind of stuck down in, down in there to see what the um, wall art is, but several of these rugs, there's like three of those rugs right there. Little game. All right, moving along over here. These containers are not packed, they're just kind of stuff just thrown in and then spilling over the top. This has lots of games. I see cards against humanity. Oh, this is cool. We got a Coke. Is this Monopoly or? Oh, that's really cool. There, look. Coca Cola Opoly. Man, it stinks in here. And it's. It looks pretty good. I mean, the money and stuff's kind of coming. Coming out of place there. But look at all those pieces yeah. there. I don't even that know if it was really. Yeah. Really used. But Cocopoly, there's Fort, Fortnite Monopoly. I already pointed that out. We got Monopoly Jenga. I've never seen that before. I mean, it's probably at the store. I've just never noticed it. Uno Ultimate Marvel. All right, so some cool games. Moving along. Okay, let's look at this now that I got two hands. <clears throat> I think it's a nebulizer. Yeah, that's what it's. So, oh look, it's a penguin nebulizer. Now I see what this is. This is an igloo. The bag looks like an igloo. That's kind of creative there. Games up here's another case. Probably. Oh man, it's heavy. Probably poker chips. It's a poker set, and yes, it is. It's like they're all there. They're just kind of coming, spilling out a little bit. Big blind, small blind. Moving along. Look at this. We got a little <clears throat> statue. It's kind of cool. Terracotta statue. And a St. Simon's Island ship. It's like a little souvenir. A four leaf clover. And then I think these are supposed to be like gold flakes. It's like a souvenir thing, I believe. Moving along here, paperwork. What is this? What is this? This oh, this is really cool. It's a little um, tiki torch, but look, it looks like a little 
kind of a little bit looks like um squidward's house but yeah it's like it's terracotta and you put the oil in there and then you light it on that's really cool do we have anything down in here nope nope and nope and what's in here a little file thing here and just um paperwork a little paperwork okay keep moving down this side here got an RC car but missing the battery there it's for the Piper let's see what this I think this is just all nerf guns yeah a whole bunch of nerf guns here and this one so I don't know five six seven nerf guns it looks like right there pile of clothes here on the floor we're not gonna get back in there yet what is this this might be actual trash all right I'm gonna move up here I don't know what's that what that is in there a little bit of cleaning supplies or something there I'm gonna start rolling through this stuff here let's look at this a little bit closer I see the chain hanging down there so I don't know yeah it needs to be fixed the chain needs to be put back put back on to make it pedal right down there so I'll have to kind of see if I can flip it over and we get back and look at it see if I can get that chain back on All right, and you want some water to drink? Here's some filtered water, ready to go. For the mouse. Look, they even got decon in here. Yeah. A little bit of weed be gone. Um, wash and wax. Go this way. So, clothes, I think there's gonna be some good clothes. You just gotta get stuff off the top layer. Here's a little statue. Mm -hmm. Down there in the clothes. Moving on this way, what is this? Oh, Samsung Gear VR virtual reality thing. I don't, doesn't really feel like it's in here. Um, well, actually, I think it is in there. But, man, but these things just don't really sell for a whole bunch of money. When they first came out, they did, but not anymore. At least that's my experience. All right, we got lots of books here. What kind of books do we have? I think there's some. Um, Oh, that's good right here. We got some um, Minecraft box sets here. Looks in pretty good shape too. It's all, all the books are in there. Let's see what other kind of books we have. Cat Kid Comic Club. Cat Kid. So it looks like some good books. Some ones that are popular with kids right now. I don't know if it's all kids books or not. Looks like a lot of them are though. No, 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 The Great Unknown, I don't know what that is, but... So, kids' books, and some not-kids' books. Oh, man, that one's heavy, because of all the books. All right, now, underneath that, we got the Century Safe here. And it's unlocked. So what's in here? We've got a message from the CEO and their life insurance. We got a Swiss Army knife with a little gun on it. A Sharpie, some other paperwork. Hold on, my phone's ringing here. All right, so that's just paperwork. So paperwork and a knife. It's a nice little knife though. And then what is in this gold, golden box, whatever, right here. Okay, I do see down on the floor there, it's like, see all those beans and everything? That's definitely a mouse or rat or whatever has gotten into those and, and thrown them everywhere. Or, or either they spilled them out and then the rat was drawn in. Okay, this is some kind of, some kind of toy, I don't know what this treasure is, chest. toy treasure chest, but it has the key there, but there's nothing in it. So 
them. And then this box here it looks like we got probably more more books. There's this goes to the iRobot. So let's set this over there with the iRobot. I got some kind of globe attached here. Hold on. Get this thing off. So that goes with that. And then we got the globe here. I guess you plug it in and I don't know what it does. Talks to you or something. Yeah, that's Right here. Birthday cards. We have lots of books. Look at that. We got Dr. Seuss books. Whole little stack of Dr. Seuss there. Dog Man. I said some real good kids' books. There's a lint brush. We got Marvel stuff here. Or DC. <laughs> Lego books. Anything anything Lego seems to do good. And then we got some Marvel puzzles over here. And more Pokemon. <clears throat> Another little Pokemon book there with a couple cards in it. Gym Trainer. But we got a 500 piece. Look at that. That's pretty cool. On the Thor. Thor puzzle. And then look right here. We got the classic Rubik's Cube. What is in that? Oh, we got a Magic 8 Ball. Look, Thanos. Don't know who that's supposed to be right offhand, but with the Magic 8 Ball down in there. In between all the books. Lots and lots of books. Colored around the world, Christmas stories, so kid stuff, but then some of it's not kid stuff. Alright. Slide that over. Alright. We had a dead right here at one time. But he's not here no more. He's gone. I don't know if he decomposed or what, but look, there's the outline. The tail. There's some hair matted down. We got it. I think it was underneath that though. I wonder if he got smashed or if he just mm -hmm. crawled in under there and died. died and got smashed. I don't know. <laughs> Sounds like a baby, doesn't it? <laughs> All right. Medieval times. Nunchucks. Oh, we got a Funko Pop down here. Stan Lee. That's kind of cool, a little golden Stan Lee. What's in this wooden box, and Is it treasure? No. No. Nothing. nothing in there. No treasure. Another baseball. Some little wooden pieces. Here's another baseball. It's an Atlanta Braves baseball. Um, okay, laser tag. Nothing's full right there. WD-40. This a little dartboard, or what is it? Nope, this is a... Oh, it's a Atlanta United little banner, but that's all laser tag, laser tag. Down here we got another. That's the same one right there, it, and that was in there. That's a Funko. Here's another Funko. Spider Man. He's got a, got all the spider legs on him. What that is? Spider Man web fluid. Here, drink that, and you'll be um, shooting spider spider webs out of your arms then we got a is this a bank or what is this no some kind of little pokemon maybe it's a light turn it on oh we can't use this because it's adult supervision required. adult supervision hmm. i don't think we have any adults with this and then we got um black adam here also dwayne the rock johnson there you go. <laughs> <laughs> all right so some goodies okay, down in there, in there yep oh, that's geez. um shoes we'll throw all this in there and then we got a ring box, but that's empty. It's for a little solar panel, but I can tell that's empty. Oh, we got a toolbox here. Are we gonna find any tools in it? Uh, the classic Don't Break the Ice. I used to love that game when I was a kid. I still love it now, actually. I would play it right now. You wanna play it, Ann? Yeah, let's go. All right, me and Ann, we're gonna take a two hour break here and play Don't Break the Ice. Ooh, Man, look at that. It's, it was wet inside. It's still wet. Yeah. See all that rust and it's all wet. Man, I don't know how that happened. There are tools in there, but unfortunately a lot of them are going to be rusted. It's like soaking wet in here. Very odd. I mean, it had to just been wet in there when they put it in here. 
for whatever reason and it's just been sitting there wet because nothing around this is wet but right here with these beans and stuff gosh, we got some watches let's see Charles Raymond fossil fossil that's like a smart watch right there I think and bands here some cufflinks I don't know what kind of watch that is there's no name here probably a name underneath but so that's decent wet tools a whole bunch of sockets there they got a little bit of rust on them but, but mostly look pretty good that's a rat trap right there they must have came back in here and saw that they had rats in here and put some of this the rat trap because there's one you got the decon there maybe they didn't want to come back and get their stuff they knew rats had been in here but moving over here that's for a computer like a subwoofer what do we got in here got some more tools or at least a hammer and what else All right, we got a little Willis Tower, Chicago statue. I don't know what that is. Here's a nice Duncan Butterfly yo-yo. Nice socket here, Stanley. And a power bank, maybe? Yep, oh, that's for the iRobot. Let me put that with the, put it with the robot vacuum. I'm going to keep kind of working over this way which i think a lot of this is going to be closed but i think there is some other stuff kind of buried down in there and like i keep saying besides the top layer look right here we got a braves jersey it's a youth a little freddie freeman braves jersey that's a good item here's another jersey let's see this is a another freddie freeman we got two freddie freeman jerseys i don't know probably had multiple kids with all these toys and stuff here's another braves jersey Freddie Freeman so three little Freddie Freeman jerseys and down in here look like these clothes they're all folded up so there's good clothes down in here and then right here where the iRobot is um, more clothes and look these are all folded 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 so those are all good well i mean at least not just wadded up dirty that don't mean they're all good they could still have holes or stains in them moving back all right right here on the top we got some clothes but i think there's other stuff underneath this posters what is this other stuff under the posters Looks like just some pictures and stuff, but a lot of posters. Like, that's Marvel. I see, um, looks like a Minecraft poster there. But this is a big Marvel poster. This one's, I've seen this before. That one's pretty cool. A little bit rough around the edges of the posters there. Mostly like some socks and underwear. And, uh, all right, this bag here is like bathroom stuff. I don't know what, if this is something expensive or not. Baoli, Farmasi, no idea. But if it is something expensive, that's good because it's a big old thing of cologne. But we got Dove shampoo, Dove soap. Big old thing of Q-tips. Couple razors in there. I wanted to see if there's any more cologne, but I don't see any. Suction black mask. So no more Columbus says that, and I don't know, never heard of it. Might be because it's a made up brand. All right, what are these things? Looks like some kind of little, I don't know what this is. They've been chewed on though. Jetson, almost looks like there's supposed to be wheels on the bottom and there's not. Oh, I just touched something nasty. Oh, 
All right, like that. There's a wheel in the front, but there's no wheel in the back. So I'm not really sure what this does or how it works. All right, moving up here. Looks like more books of some sort. It's like a some kind of artist kit, but what kind of books are these? Um, okay, some kind of actual school books, it looks like. All right, here, this looks like a lot of camping stuff. This is tabletop stove. Okay, the case that it goes in has been cracked, but then the actual stove there looks brand new. We got some sleeping bags. Um, that's a tent, five person tent. What is this? It's like a stuffed animal. It looks like maybe a stuffed animal snake maybe wrapped up in there. But yeah, sleeping bags. That's all what's in there, just sleeping bags. And then the tent. All right, here's the fun part. All these loose clothes, I'm taking the stuff that's kind of on the top that I see stains and nasty stuff on, putting in one bag, be trash. And then once I kind of get down and see stuff that's not bad, then we'll start bagging it up into other bags, stuff that we can sell. But loose clothes is always kind of a pain, and especially in this case where it's got mouse droppings on the stuff on the top. It's kind of nasty. All right, trying to clean up this corner here got a lot of clothes off at the top of some stuff we got a grave digger here lots of cords and so maybe the maybe a charger for the um hoverboards potentially in here what is that for that looks like it's to the um nintendo switch right there there's a little treasure chest and it's got some weight to it push that in I guess let's see that opens what in the world <laughs> there we go oh it's a little treasure it's got sand in there and little pirate stuff that's kind of cool kind of cool there all right that goes to a um, switch it's little end pieces that go on the controllers up oh, here we go you can see these right in front of me oh I hope these are in here switch games some of these can be really expensive. We got four cases. Are they going to be in here? No. 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 I go on it and no. All right. Still holding out hope though. The bottoms you'll have a little bitty case that you'll stick those in. Here's a um, sound reactive LED strip, and then. Google Chromecast. All right, what else is over here? There's part of a switch. This is part of a switch. Now have to definitely look really close. Oh, we got the Superman slot bracelet. Hold on. It needs to go right here, but my watch is there. Let me. There we go. Superman slot bracelet. I remember when these things came out when I was in elementary school. Well, they became popular. I don't know if that's when they first came out or not. So lots of cords, different stuff in there. Unfortunately, the, the games are not in there for the Switch. And then we got the duck glasses here. <laughs> so we're still looking for the Switch and the Switch games. All right, we got the Thanos hand. And look, he's got all the infinity stones. Makes a little bit of noise there. But that's pretty cool. I guess that's the only one that makes noise is the middle one. There. So, more toys. Oh, what's down underneath here? Let's see. Oh, there's a whole bunch of Hot Wheels. And stuff down in the bottom there's like a an organizer down there and see all that it's full of the cars goon squad there's a space jam toy it looks like we got a buzz lightyear hand too yep you put that on and then let's see uh, 
probably need some some fresh batteries but we got the buzz light your hand we got the thanos hand an iron some hot wheel stuff up we got spider-man i think this is thor here we've got thor up oh, captain america some swords more hot wheel stuff medieval time swords no batteries on those we do have a like a little probably a toy chest right there all right the secret trunk here probably more toys based off of everything else man maybe a um family of rats living in here oh sorry mice and doesn't want to say rats they're mice oh my ann more nerf guns they have a lot of nerf this is like my son when he was a kid that's all he wanted was nerf guns from the time he was like six or seven to about 11 or 12 i mean just nerf guns nerf guns nerf guns they got plenty of them and a weird etch-a-sketch not a normal one but all right nerf guns nerf guns are expensive though all right we've moved all the mattresses out that were right in this area got up most of the little stuff up there we still got that but now we're to a new batch of boxes and stuff. there's a lot of pictures right here and more of the same toys there was some stuffed animal there here i just took out because they were just kind of, every time i touched it they were spilling out and most of those were kind of dirty but more um more nerf guns we got a braves number one finger there let's see what else we got more more nerf guns lots of nerf gun minions let's see what is this cowboy air mega probably an air purifier yeah i think that's what that is air purifier got a little plain styrofoam but it's a little bit bent up so i don't think it's gonna fly too well we got a husky little organizer with some hardware in it those always do well we got one 30 pound um dumbbell there if we keep going back we got bikes a minion some homemade art let's see if we can check some of these other containers here looks like more toys this is the big boy up oh, yeah my son he had this nerf gun these things are not cheap these big nerf guns like this I don't know what that is some kind of toy so we got um paul patrol needs a little wipe off but paul patrol us i think there's a new movie coming out so maybe get some bids on some paul patrol stuff if that's where we put it little state puzzle there giant floor puzzle we got more paul patrol see some other paul patrol other toys down in there a little toy guitar first act those always sell the guitars always sell even the toy ones there always do all right Looks like sheets let's keep moving down this way here's a dirty a dirty little pillow we get down here what do you know more toys do we have legos in here big lego container let's see oh, we got a little few legos that's another good seller i said toys can be good as long as it's not those just big bands of mixed up pieces even sometimes that can turn out good but you know what i'm saying stomp rocket here's a pokemon not a lego but a um mega block figure there see in there um i think this is yep beyblades arena looks like some beyblade stuff down in there like the little toys they kind of spin around and you have little fights with them lots of containers with no lids a couple lids but mostly no lids a little smashed up lamp Whoa. coat rack you hang on the wall few decorative pieces here Let's... oh okay uh, PS it was right here I didn't even notice until just now PS5 box 
but I think it's empty just like the switch box. Yep, it's empty. That stinks. So just finding either one of those in there would have been huge, either the switch or the PS5. But as of yet, I haven't found any of that. More toys, just lots of loose toys. Here's a Batmobile. So we got a Batmobile. Get down in here. Oh, another one of these guys. <laughs> got some shorts I got. Hold on, I think we got Woody and Buzz down here. Oh, we got the Incredible Hulk mask. Pirate mask. Black Panther mask. And these are the ones that have a little button you push in it. Um, if they work, then it will kind of make a noise. I think that's the button there, right there. So it probably needs batteries. But yeah, here we go. We got Buzz. Buzz Lightyear. We got Woody. I wonder if it's hats down in there or not. This isn't the really good one. Doesn't actually have the pull string like the nice ones have. And then down in here we got we got Yoshi and Mario on the four wheelers. I think these are probably like RC. No, that's Monster Jam. That's probably to that Grave Digger. So I don't know if the, the Mario and Yoshi controllers are not in here at least. All right, some bags here. We get, looks like a pretty nice cuisine art waffle maker. You know, one of those that flip around, stainless steel. Looks pretty good. Let's flip this around. There are a couple containers back here with lids. Just a few. We got art supplies and crayons and markers, all that kind of stuff. Um, more art supplies, pipe cleaner. There's a lot of paint down in there, popsicle sticks kind of thing. Chalk, Play-Doh. The top of that thing is nasty, but let's see. Oh lord, that's not a good box. This is all like kids schoolwork. That's going to be heavy. Um, this looks like some Christmas right here. Some kind of blow up down in there. 2018 Mickey and Minnie snow globe. Let's check this one here. I hope it's not more schoolwork okay no but it's more <laughs> more toys giant sunglass for it. nerf guns i'm just hoping to find that one with the gaming stuff in it maybe after we found those the empty boxes and the empty um the empty cases for the switch games all right if you want to see the number one selling set of end tables out there if you buy storage units you know these little ikea end tables with the screw on legs i don't know how many of these i've gotten over the year there's a set right there at least a hundred of these things at least but you see all those bags ain't had those little white kitchen bags back there that's what all the kitchen stuff was thrown in those white garbage bags dishes and all that stuff all right christmas stuff we got the little short nutcracker. We got the snowman nutcracker, and it's an advent calendar. We got a camo Santa hat, and down under there, there's all kinds of Christmas, it looks like. Christmas ornaments. Oh, no ornament there. I thought there was going to be a cool ornament. There's a Hawaii ornament. Santa. Santa's climbing the, the palm tree to get a coconut, I guess. Twenty twenty is the date on that one. Wonder shop at Target. There's a little Target nutcracker. What else we got? Oh, those are actually Toy Story stockings, I think. Let's look down further. We got some homemade. We get the homemade Christmas ornaments. Look at that one. It's a big mess it's just kind of all 
thrown in there. There's another little homemade, but just kind of a tangled up mess, but ugh. And I keep finding weird stuff to touch every now and then. Oh, and over here in all these pictures and everything, Ann just found this. This is actually pretty cool. It's a Tony Gonzalez autograph. Tony Gonzalez, he's tied in, ended up, he played for the Falcons in, but he played for Kansas City for years. Hall of Fame tied in. We got the autograph, we get the picture. So that's pretty cool right there. Good little find. All right, we're down to mainly just this corner right here that we haven't looked at. Oh, there's a case over here, hold on. Down here on the ground. There's a sound bar laying right there, but let's look and see what's in this case underneath there. There's a heater. Here's a Sonic lunchbox. Nothing in it, well. Ugh, there's an old lunch in there. They literally, it's like the trash from some kid's lunch and it's just been in there forever. There's a, a smashed Yoohoo thing and it looks like there's Yoohoo oh, and other stuff. Ugh. Oh, it stinks now over here. Then I opened that. Yeah. The thing been sealed up for who knows how long with old lunch in it. All right, here's a vaults case. Let's see. It's heavy. There's something in it. Oh, it's a CD. Or they got, look, bootleg, Halloween, Ocean's 12, mostly bootleg. There is a couple real ones, Final Destination 3, but that's the DVD case right there. This looks like a bunch of notebooks and stuff because it's clear and you can see on the side. But let's check and see. We got certificates, looks like notebooks and stuff from school. picture uh, photo album yep yeah, there is that's a cool little rock and it's got like a little cover like a little bold out area there you can put something in some kind of rock there and just more books and notebooks parenting show that okay all right moving along here one last corner there's some nasty looking stuff kind of on the top there another lunch box is it does it have an old lunch in it nope it's empty it's just dirty on the outside and that one feels empty too they're both just a little dingy dirty on the outside look It's a pile of crap with horns on it. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, I've never seen one. I, I guess that's bull crap. Oh, that's bull crap. That's what we say, bull. Here's some bull crap. <laughs> a Batman bucket. That's kind of cool there. Spider-Man bucket. And let's see anything under there. Not really a pair of binoculars. Little Tasco binoculars. So, not much else going on. Here's some Crunchberry, Captain Crunch. Crunchberry, that's, you know, one of the things drawing in the mice in here and stuff like this. But, for the most part, that is it. Unless there's just something that we have missed, but I don't think we're going to find the gaming systems. Could find the games, you never know. Could find something. I don't know, what, what is that? Oh, it's a lion. Okay, I see it now. A lion, that looks like another lion picture of some sort. I don't know, let me look at this right here. This is like a shadow box, I think. What's in it? Mm -hmm. See it, how it's hinged on that side? Yeah. Oh, ooh. Oh, wow, look at this. Last minute find here. We got a certificate of authenticity. This is a Jerry Rice autographed jersey. PSA certified there. You never know what you're gonna find. You gotta look at it, look at everything. I mean, it, just never know. I mean, it was over here mostly, oh, it's better quit showing that, mostly kind of family pictures, cheap little canvas pictures. So we got the Tony Gonzalez autograph, but this is even better. This is really nice. And certified Jerry Rice autograph jersey. That's awesome, actually, right there. I'll take one last look around here. This last thing that's facing the other way, because you never know. Nope, just a some standard art. And the good thing is, is that's in good shape. Nothing, 
You got in there and mess with it. But we got to finish cleaning up all of this crap. It's also a washing machine. I already pointed that from the very beginning, but pretty decent looking washing machine. Obviously needs a little cleanup on the top like they all do. But that'll be a chunk there, probably $150 or more on that. So the unit, it'll make some money. That right there is going to be worth a little chunk right there. Unfortunately, found the boxes for the gaming systems and that they weren't in there. Found a box for a handgun, it wasn't in there. Um, rats, mice, they you were. know, all that kind of stuff was in here. Not to mention there were a few things that will had dog hair and smelled like a dog. But Nerf guns. Overall, it's, not, it's an all right unit. Not a good or great unit, not a bad unit, just kind of all right. It'll make some money. Could have been way better if the rats wouldn't have gotten here and messed some of the stuff up. It would have been better. And then obviously we would have found some of the stuff that the boxes were. But that's how it goes. But overall, it's going to make money. Just, you know, like I always say, there's so much volume in here. So much stuff. When it comes to all the toys and books and clothes, when all that stuff adds up, definitely make some money. But that's it for this one. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment if you haven't already. If you want to see us buy more units like this one. Some that would be even worse than this one, nastier than this one, and then some that are way, way better when we find literal treasure, cash money, gold, coins. Who knows? Subscribe to the channel. Y'all have a good one. All right, we got this unit back now. We're unloading it, and we figured out that this was actually a single dad's unit. There were a few men's clothing items, and then we found some pictures of a dad and three boys. It was all boy stuff. No girl stuff, no little girl stuff. There was no woman stuff, but it makes perfect sense because it looked like most all they had was um, toys. Like the dad was just buying toys, you know, to play with his sons with. Nerf guns, perfect toy for dad and sons to play with. Video games and books, Legos, stuff like that. And then, you know, as far as decor, there was very, very little decor. And then the kitchen stuff kind of looked like an afterthought. A couple of nice kitchen items like the waffle maker, but most of it was just thrown into garbage bags. So, and then just a couple pieces of furniture, but yeah, no women's clothing, no jewelry, very little decor. A couple of the decor pieces were like an autographed jersey and another autographed piece. So definitely looks like a single dad unit and that's what it was based off of everything that we saw. But um, don't get very many single dad units. We do have gotten a few, you get some man units, but they normally don't have, you know, a whole lot of kid stuff. Maybe a few things, cause you know, I guess typically single dad, doesn't take the kids the majority of the time. But this looked like the dad probably was the main one with these kids here. Anyways, what happened, not sure. Hopefully they moved on to bigger and better things from this unit. You know, we have no idea, but that's what it is, single dad unit.